Okay, everybody, today we are going to do the rubber sleeve. The purpose of this one is to show you the revolve feature and the hole feature on it, part of it. So here we get to it. So we'll have a bunch of little videos really quick, and let's get going. Create document up on the top left. Let's call it rubber sleeve. Hey, once you're in Tom shape here, it's going to load up our workspace, and we're doing just the revolve. The units don't really care about, and also this size I don't really care about. Create a sketch onto here. We are essentially going to create an L. So as soon as it gets into view here, let's pop it up. I'm going to use a series of lines. Come up. I'm using about a quarter of an inch. Come over 0.5. Let's uh, zoom up. Let's go about, I don't know, three and a half inches up. A little bit over. Down. And back. Like I said, it is not important about the actual size. Click. Go into Revolve. Select the face, the revolve axis. I'm going to pick right here. So I click on that little red box. Click there. Now it revolves. Hit the check mark. Let's add a quick fillet around the outside. Uh, 0.125 looks good to me. If you want to go a little bit bigger, sure. Go for it. Check mark. Good. So now we have a fillet top and bottom. Come to the bottom. And uh, let's see if we can get a point on there. So let's go sketch. Create that as a sketch plane. Put a point right there. It's done. Check. Come to the hole tool, click, select that point, and that puts a hole in there. And you can do various different sizes, but if I want a 0.5 inch hole on the bottom of that, click, check mark, and check again. And that was using the hole tool right there to put a hole in the bottom of it. That is a rubber sleeve. What we're going to do now, let's right click on the part. Let's go assign material. Wait for this to populate. Go to none. Let's type in neoprene. There it is. So we got a neoprene handle. That's it. There you go. You want to change the color? You're more than welcome to. Uh, now we can do the properties of it. Click bottom right. Come over to part one. And there are the properties. Gives you the mass of it and anything else you would like. So that is how you make a rubber sleeve or neoprene sleeve using the revolve feature and the whole function to put a little hole in the bottom of it. All right, people. Have a great day. Bye.